Hello again, it's Dr. Andrea Maxim, naturopathic doctor in Caledonia and Oakville, and today is day four of my seven-day vegetable-only medical food detox. It's also day two back at work, and although today wasn't too bad, I wasn't too hungry, I didn't mind the shakes actually, which I thought would you know, be kind of kicking in by this time, considering I've had three shakes a day of the same stuff. Um, but everything seems to be going okay. Work was okay. Everything ran very smoothly, which was good. Um, one of my personal goals over the past couple months has been trying to remain as cool and calm as possible. I'm trying not to let stress affect me too much, trying not to obsess over the things that have happened in the past or the things that I can't control. And I found over the past few weeks that I've actually been able to let a lot of negativity roll off my back and I've become a lot more self-assured and self-aware. Um, during this cleanse, it actually helped to speed up the process a little bit for me. So the liver is common, commonly the organ that takes the brunt of our stress. Our liver is our main detoxifying organ. And so often when we're thinking about a lot of negative things or when we're harboring a lot of negative emotions, the liver can start stirring up a lot of irritability and anger. Um, and even though it was one of my busiest days at the clinic, I found that I didn't get as rattled as I normally do. If something quickly changed in my schedule, it didn't throw me off. I just kind of rolled with the punches. And it was actually a really wonderful experience for me to acknowledge and really say, you know what, I think this detox is doing what it's supposed to do. It's a very subtle change, but it's, it's very positive. And then the evening came, and we were having one of our monthly meetings with a networking group that I have in Ancaster, and we went to a beautiful cafe, and inside the glass display case were these mousse cakes, croissants, scones, and people all around me were having these wonderful pizzas and dinners and that sort of thing, and it only reminded me of what I couldn't have and also reminded me about how much I hate eating vegetables. However... I know that there's only three more days left and I can certainly get through this as I know you can too. And then I came home and was pretty much the most irritable that I had been all week. As soon as my car pulled in the driveway, I knew I was going to pick a fight over something. It's not even garbage day um, and I decided that all the garbages had to be cleaned out of the house and that we had to get ready for garbage day even though it's two nights from now and just decided I was going to pick a huge fight. Um, and... The next hour, while I kind of festered after exploding on people around me, I had my salad and my last detox. I decided, you know what, it's just time for me to go to bed. It's a very common thing for people to get a little bit irritable as our body is purging itself. It's also common for you to feel a little bit more fatigued. So please just go to sleep if you need to. It's a lot better than causing problems or unnecessary drama at home. I'm really hoping that day five will get a lot better. I'm certainly count, counting the days, as I'm sure you are. Um, but we'll see how it goes, and I will see you tomorrow.